We are the Ploops, and today we got a fun Christmas challenge for Vlogmas Day 7. Seven days through. There's a week right there. Good job, good job. Good stuff. <laughs> but tonight, guys, we got a fun game for you guys. We are doing Minute to Win It Christmas Edition. Christmas Edition. So if you come over here. Come here, babe. Man, I just got comfy. Come here, come here, come here. Babe, we got multiple Christmas games that we are going to do. And do you know how Minute to Minute, Minute to Win It works? I do. Do you want to explain it? Basically, you got a minute to complete a challenge and win it. Yeah, so we're doing all Christmas. That was great, babe. That was fantastic. <laughs> so it's going to be me versus my wife, Danielle. And we are. I think see. we start with. Bowling. We'll start up with penguin bowling. Here we go. Guys, we'll get this all set up, but drop a like on this video. If you guys want a part two of Minute to Win It Christmas Edition, we got many other fun challenges that we could do. We are matching freaking onesies on. What could be any better? We're gonna get all set up and we'll see you guys when we do it. Oh. Okay, guys, for this first one, penguin pin knockdown. We have 60 seconds to knock down as many pins as possible. And I have to stand on the tile behind the carpet and throw the ball. All right, babe, are you ready to start? I'm ready. My Minute to win it, number on. one. Hold on. Very important part of this. Set a timer for 60 seconds. Go. Oh, she's got one more. She's got one more to get. Yeah! You did it in eight <laughs> seconds. You did it in eight seconds. Good job, babe. That's what I'm freaking talking Eat about. Eat my waffles. Okay, sir. Here we I go. I one throw to knock them all down. Or else I'm screwed because you did it super fast. Set a timer for 60 seconds. Oh my god! Stop your timer! I think I beat you, but we'll have to see on the screen in the video because Colin will put up the actual timer and stop it when it actually stops. I'm not sure. And then the next one. All right, guys, next up is candy cane catch. And this one, me and Danielle will be standing on the chairs. We each have six candy canes and 60 seconds. We drop the candy canes from where we're standing on top of the chair. And the objective is to get the candy cane to land on the ribbon without it falling off. The person with the most candy canes on the ribbon in 60 seconds wins. Okay, babe, are you ready? I'm ready. Three, two, one. Oh, jeez, I completely missed the ribbon completely there. <gasps> oh my god, you almost passed off your other one. I feel like the <gasps> No! Oh, Danielle's got two on so far. <gasps> no! Okay, I have to make these two to tie. Come on. Come on! Okay. Come on! Good game. Good game. <gasps> oh, I just you broke a key. <laughs> that one was coins. I was gonna mail it to him. <laughs> oh man, you did it way before 60 seconds too. You still got five I seconds. Did. Four, three, two, one. Good job, babe. Declared winner on that one. Good job. Thank you. Hey guys, so I'm interrupting today's video for a little sponsor. I wanted to thank GT Racing for the chair that they sent me for Ryan. Many of you guys may not know, but Ryan has his office space in here and he hasn't had a chair to sit on. He's been sitting on one of my makeup chairs for so long and he's been wanting a chair really bad to have in his office and just have it be super comfy and something he can adjust and all that kind of stuff. Well, GT Racing sent us a chair for him and I've already set it up and I'm super excited to get his reaction for it. So I'm gonna set up the camera in the corner and I'm gonna tell him to come in here and you guys are gonna see his reaction. He has been wanting this for so long and it's finally here. So let's do it. All right, Danielle told me to look at the camera first. Say this is a sponsor. She said, I'll find out once I get in. No. <laughs> what? I No way, it's a GT racing chair. Dude, these things are sick. No way, look at this. 
Look at this thing, guys. Holy cow. I've been needing a new chair for a long, long, long time. I literally sat on like a bar stool. Not even. At one point, I was just sitting on like a footrest for the longest time just because I didn't buy myself a chair. I don't know why. It wasn't the first thing on my list. There was a lot more high priorities. But look at this thing. Holy cow. These things are so sick. Okay. Well, thank you so much, GT Racing, the sponsor of today's video. Holy cow. Danielle set this up, I didn't even know about this. Okay, check this out. So there's a little lever here, you pull it, and I can go all the way down, literally like I'm just sleeping. I can take a nap in my chair. And check this out. This thing has a full on footrest. Pop it out, spin it over. You can have it at any length. You're kidding, and, and, so smooth, so smooth. This chair is so comfortable. But the coolest part, actually, two favorite things. These two pillows are nice, very nice support for your back, very nice support for your neck as well. But, let's see if this is the version. It is, it's got the speakers. No way, guys, check this out. Check this out, give me a sec. This is my song and it's coming from the chair right now. So, so, so cool. If you guys want to get the best gaming chair, comfortable chair, anything for a gaming room, office, good setup, just being able to have a nice chair in an office space, guys, go to gtracing.com and get yourself a chair. There's also some awesome Christmas promotions going on over at gtracing.com, so go get yourself a gift, treat yourself, or go get someone you think would enjoy this chair over at gtracing.com. I'm hyped about this. <laughs> Anyways, jump back to the video. Okay, this is snowball fight. On one end, there's going to be a ping pong ball that you try to get into the water bowl. And on the other side, the defender is gonna be throwing cotton balls, trying to get them not to go into the bowl. The person who gets the most ping pong balls into the water bowl in 60 seconds wins. Here we go. I got it, snowball's ready. Three, two, one, go. Ain't nothing going in. Boom. Oh, off the rim. So hard to hit it with snowballs. Keep it in the damage. Yes! Oh, you got one! You got one! Oh my god, I'm not gonna worry about that one. Come on, it's so hard to hit these things. Oh my! Keep getting off the rim. Here, I'll help you. Here you go. Oh, you're trying to cheat me? Oh, not in my house. Let's go, baby. This is my house. <laughs> Get out. Oh, I put a top ball in there. Come on, bring it on, babe. <laughs> I'm telling you, let's go. Only one, okay, I let, I let one slide, all right. You let one slide? Yeah. Ping pong throw. <laughs> Are you I am in three, two, one. 60 seconds, just gotta be one. There's one. Uh-oh. Oh, wait. Uh-oh, there's one already. Oh, did you hit that? All I gotta get, one more. One more. Hard to hit it, huh? <laughs> That's it. Okay. I need to get my ping pong balls. Here we go. One more. Boom. Oh, you got it. Look at my ping pong balls. Come on, one more. Ten seconds. Oh no. Think right. Ah! No! It's tied. What do we do? It's tied. What happened? We tied. We tied. So, one on one tiebreaker. Let's do it. Two. All right, it's time to sell this. Three, time. two, one, go! Oh, you think you're faster than huh? Oh no! Uh uh Not today. Oh, okay. There's one. Rapid fire snowballs. Oh, I hit it, but I almost helped you. She's running. She's hustling. She's getting her. She's getting her freaking snowballs. Uh oh! Not even worried about that one. Uh oh! Not my house, baby. Let's go. It's our house. Oh oh! Ooh. Last minute, I bought that in for you. Three, two, one, start. Gotta be two, here we go. Let's see if I can start off strong again with one. Nope, one. Yep. Ah, you splashed me. Let's go, come on, baby. That's two. That's two! Three! All right, guys, for this next one called Jingle Bell Bash, one person will be on the other side of the counter and you roll the jingle bells at the ornaments and you have 60 seconds to knock down as many as you can. All right, babe, your 60 seconds starts in three, two, one, go. 
Oh my gosh, it's two down already. Roland did make it. Uh oh. Oh my gosh, she got one more knockdown. I think she's at six right now, or five, five or six right now. Oh my so god! I'm oh, sorry. Good job. Thank you. Good job, babe. That was good. Okay, Ryan, start the timer. Three, two, one, go. That's two to one. That is two to one. Oh boy. This challenge is called presents gone missing. And pretty much we're gonna each take our different colored pine cones, hide them all around the house, and the person that finds the most pine cones in 60 seconds wins the challenge. All right, babe, your minute to start hiding pine cones starts now. Okay, Ryan. All right. Got yours all hidden? They're all hidden. Okay. Okay, you ready for me to go searching? I'm ready. You coming with? Yeah. Okay, ready? Three, two, one. Okay, look for pink pine cones. Pink pine cones. Pink pine cones. <laughs> this is, oh, I got one, I got one. All right, that's one, that's one, that's one. Okay, come on. Come on, Ryan, think. Can't be that too hard to find. Come on. Pink pine cones. I feel like you're into the bathroom. Had it. Yep, there's two. 18 seconds left, I'm only at two. Three. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Four, six seconds left. Let's go, baby. In this box. Oh, there was one right there. Does that count or no? No. No. Go oh. try and find the other ones, though. All right, guys, going back to hiding. We're going to put one on top of the Alexa right there. Boom. Kind of blends with the trash can. Put it right there. Okay. I gotta win this one, guys. I know she'll still technically win because it's two to one. So even if I win, it's only one. But go into her makeup room here. Put one right on the back. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? Getting your Three, feet ready. Two, one, Mario! Okay, all right. She's hunting. She's hunting. <laughs> She's shaking the tree. She's thinking it's in the tree. <laughs> Uh oh, uh oh, oh, she found one, there's one. There's two, there's two. Oh, she's going, oh, there's three. <laughs> oh, she's cruising. 40 seconds left, she's cruising. She's going fast. Where's it gonna be? Is there one in here? There is, there's four. There's four, four left. If she can't find any more, I win. No, it's tie. No, we tie, we tie, we tie. 21 seconds, 21 seconds. I mean, you already won, because it's two to one, but who cares, keep going. Keep hustling. Where are we at? Where are we at? Where we got seven seconds left. Seven seconds left. Three, two, one. There it is, babe. Okay, we tied. But you technically won, babe. You have won the first ever Ploof's Christmas Minute to win it. Congratulations, yeah, everyone, guys. Do you have a winner speech? Winner speech. Wow, I can't believe I did that. Really proud of myself, but also kind of mad because I thought I found them all. You did a freaking amazing you job. You did terrible. Do you want to do it? What? I thought I did decent. Loser speech. Loser speech. You know, honestly, I'm proud of my wife. She did a great job. She's kind of a sore loser, so. That's how we get her. No, she won fair and square. Great job, babe. With that being said, thank you guys so much for watching today's video. And what, babe? And we will see you tomorrow. Tomorrow. Peace out, guys. Woo.